Guys, this is part two of our 20 expressions that use the word dream. In this video, we are learning expressions 11 through 20. If you haven't already watched the first part, you can find a link to the video in the description below. The next expression is broken dreams. Broken dreams are plans or goals that have failed or have been abandoned. For example, Hollywood is full of failed actors and broken dreams. Or, many people go to Las Vegas to get rich but leave with broken dreams. <laughs> I never got any stuffed animals growing up. Oh wait, actually that's not true. I did. My dad gave me a stuffed puppy the day he bailed on us. I'm just f***ing with you. <laughs> that is a weird joke. I thought your dad abandoned your family. You... No, he did walk out on us though. Oh. But he didn't even leave me a stuffed puppy. Just broken dreams. Oh. Las Vegas, a city built upon sand, broken dreams, and five dollar lobster. Next we have sweet dreams. You can say sweet dreams to someone before she goes to bed, and it means you hope she sleeps well and has good dreams. Kiora S. Kiora S. What time is it? What time is it? Time for bed. Sweet dreams, Jelly Bean. I'll play the music to let you know it's coming. The rest is on you. You ready? Ready! Sweet dreams. Next is the expression, somebody's wet dream. A wet dream is a very erotic or sexual dream that causes a dreamer to have an orgasm. However, this is also often used figuratively, and when we say that something is someone's wet dream, we mean it is something that is very appealing to that person. The someone here can be a specific person, but it is more commonly a type of person. For example, a classic car show is a car lover's wet dream. Be careful when using this expression because it is very informal and a bit vulgar. The primary market was Africa. Eleven major conflicts involving 32 countries in less than a decade. A gunrunner's wet dream. At People, oh, thank you. Look. You know, your house is Frank's wet dream. Never gonna get him out. The next expression is to dream big. To dream big means to not settle for small goals, but instead to push yourself beyond your comfort zone and take more risks. People who dream big don't listen to other people who tell them they can't do something. They have high standards for their lives and are able to motivate themselves to work hard and achieve their dreams. You got a lot of cities there. <gasps> You're gonna have a dream. Might as well dream big, right? Right. You know, 50 Cent told me he made 50 mil in music and 150 mil in vitamin water. Maybe we can make that. I just like to be able to pay my rent. <laughs> well, you gotta dream big. Next up is like a dream. If someone or something does something like a dream, they do it very well. For example, Sweater Cat's new sweater fits like a dream. Or my new guitar plays like a dream. Kind of like a dream. Drives like a dream, huh? <laughs> making a nightmare, huh? Next, we have the American dream. The American dream is the belief that anyone living in the United States has an equal opportunity of becoming successful just by working hard. Many people have moved to the U.S. from other countries, hoping to achieve the American dream. However, nowadays, this expression is sometimes used in a negative way, as some people think that the American dream is a lie or it's just an obsession with money and material things. All of my heroes are self-made. Rocky, Scarface, all the guys from The Godfather, they all started out with nothing and built their way to perfection. The way to prove yourself is to better yourself. That's the American dream. Imagine a business where people hand you money and you hand them back absolutely nothing. Now that's a real American dream. The next expression is to dream of or about. We can, of course, use this expression literally to refer to someone or something that we saw in a dream. However, when we say we dream of or about doing something, this means we often fantasize or think about doing it and have a strong desire to do it. For example, many people dream of working for themselves and being their own boss. What's something you dream about doing? Let us know in the comments. It's a boy I'd scurry away from my father at the market when he does deals just to peek over the wall. 
dream of perhaps crossing it one day, seeing it for myself. Really? So you, you were here looking over there? Oh, yes. My whole life I dreamed about coming to the Caribbean. It's so beautiful. Next is the expression to dream up something. To dream up something means to use your imagination to invent something. This expression is often used to talk about making a plan or thinking of a solution to a problem. For example, if you want to improve your English fluency, you should dream up a learning plan that you follow every day. You can also use this expression after someone says something you think is silly or ridiculous. An example of this is, no way you saw a dragon in your backyard. You dreamed that up. As a species, we're fundamentally insane. But more than two of us in a room, we pick sides and start dreaming up reasons to kill one another. Why do you think we invented politics and religion? I told you exactly what to do. You didn't even come close. Well, maybe it's right on the nose. I mean, how do we know? Maybe it's not vicious at all. Maybe it's gentle, even has feelings. Where'd you dream of that shit? Next up is would never or not dream of. When you say you wouldn't dream of doing something, this means you would never even consider doing it. This might be because it is very bad, wrong, or silly. For example, I would never dream of not giving you an example of this expression. You know how important this is to me. And when that special moment happens, I just... I want it to be perfect. I would never dream of rushing you. Don't turn your back on me, Scar. Oh no, Mufasa. Perhaps you shouldn't turn your back on me. Is that a challenge? Temper, temper. I wouldn't dream of challenging you. Finally, we have the expression, a dream come true. A dream come true is something you have finally attained after wanting it for a long time. This can be something you have been wishing for, or it can be a major life goal you have been trying to achieve. An example of this is, helping you guys learn English is a dream come true for me. You also often hear people use this expression to describe an experience that was awesome or amazing. For example, if your friend asks you how your vacation was, you can say, it was amazing. It was like a dream come true. Oh, it would be a dream come true for me to see my one grandchild's wedding. A dream come true. Mm -hmm. So you'll do it? Mm -hmm. Before I'm dead? Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> You applied to college? Why didn't you tell me? I did tell you. I thought you were telling me you wanted to apply yourself to making a collage. And as I recall, I was against it. I can't believe I got in. It's like a dream come true. An expensive dream. <clears throat> okay, guys, those are 20 common expressions that use the word dream. I tried to be very thorough in this lesson and included every dream expression that I could find. However, I'm sure I missed at least two or three, so if you know any others, please let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next lesson.